bustling with gamblers, gangsters, and sassy showgirls, five-time Tony Award-winning Guys and Dolls is celebrating Broadway's golden era. Yeah, we're excited. We have a cast member of the hit musical joining us this morning. She plays Miss Adelaide Lauren Weinberg. But first, here's a clip of the show. You meet a gent paying all kinds of rent for a flat that could flatten a Taj Mahal. Call him sad, call him funny, but it's better than even money. Uh, so exciting. If you haven't seen it, Lauren, so, uh, first of all, congratulations. Thank you. Um, Thank you. This has been performing. How, how many days has it been? So uh, we're on our 43rd performance. Oh. Yes, we opened December 26th. Uh, we won run through the end of May. Uh, so we're in about our first leg of the tour, and we're very, very excited about it. Um, well, that's yeah. a, it's a busy time for yeah. someone on stage like that to be going, crossing the country, traveling, yeah. and getting on stage, you know, almost every night. Yes. And, uh, and using your voice and singing. How did you get ready to do this? Is there a boot camp? <laughs> <laughs> a very short period of boot camp. Yeah. We actually rehearse for about two weeks mm -hmm. uh, in New York City, and then we have a short tech uh, rehearsal period, um, which is where we build the sets and the lights and build in the costumes. Um, that is about a week period of time as well. Uh, so it's very short. So a lot of, like any other job, it's on-the-job training. Uh, oh. You learn how to work together, uh, what is expected of you, how to preserve your voice, how to preserve your body. Um, so, um, yeah, it's, uh, it's, it's a, a job any, like any other job, you know, you train for it. Takes it. some training. It ta definitely yeah. takes some training, yeah. Well, for some people that may not be familiar with Guys and Dolls, mm -hmm. uh, first of all, just tell us a little bit about the synopsis um, and then your character in it. Sure, of course. So uh, it takes place in the early 1950s mm -hmm. in New York City or a uh, fantastical New York City called Runyon Land. Um, it's, the story centers around four different characters. Um, uh, Sky Masterson, yeah. who is a gangster in New York City, who falls in love with an uptight mission girl, Sarah Brown, and it is about how their love story unfolds. Uh, then there is... Um, excuse me, uh, Nathan <laughs> Detroit, uh, who is another gambler who falls in love or has been in love with my character, Miss Adelaide, ah. for 14 years. Uh, she's uh. a chronically ill nightclub performer, probably brought on by the fact that she has been engaged with the same man for 14 years. Mm. Uh, so you have the love story and you also have the comedy between those two couples. Well, this has been going on for decades now. Do you remember the first time you saw this musical and what you felt, what emotions went through your head? Of course. I grew up with the movie with okay. Marlon Brando and Frank Sinatra. Um, my mother always used to sing me a bushel and a peck. I love you, uh. a bushel and a peck growing up. Um, so I think the show is incredibly nostalgic for a lot of people. Um, there is a lot of very catchy numbers. Uh, there's a lot of recognizable characters and lines and jokes. Um, Luck to be a lady, I think, is one of the songs. Luck be a lady, yeah. absolutely. People recognize that. That's Sit down, one. you're rocking the boat as well, yeah. uh, which is a definite crowd pleaser. Um, so uh, seeing that movie and then watching it translate to stage has just been a joy, not only because it's so nostalgic, but also just because it's a, you know, it's, there's a reason why it has, it has been around for over 50 years. So. Yeah, I love it. And tonight is the final performance. So if you haven't had a chance to see it, this is your, your chance. It's tonight at the Granada Theater. What time does the show, show start? Eight 8 p.m. 8 p.m. Yes. And there's still tickets available. I know that these get sold out pretty quickly. Yes, I'm sure there are, but just a few. So. Okay. Uh, make sure you check it out, guys and dolls. We've got to go check out comedy tonight. It's a little late for us. I know, I know. I'm sorry. <laughs> but, uh, Lauren Weinberg, thank you so much for joining of us. Course. Good luck with everything, with the whole tour. Definitely. And uh, we'll see you back for another tour, yeah, possibly. Hopefully, <laughs> yeah, hopefully. Congratulations. Thank to you. you so yeah. much. Thank